man. All right. Well, now we're gone to another Bad Magic episode. Uh, this particular one, um, it's a deck I call uh, Black Walkers um, because it's built around black planeswalkers. It splashes white, and I forget why. Maybe Oath to Kaya? Oath of Kaya? This card? Oath of Kaya? But I don't know why I splashed white. I don't remember. Regardless, it's supposed to be built around black planeswalkers, and so here you go. Um, monocolored deck. I'm not. Have I played a monocolored deck on this series yet? Hmm, something to think about. Oh, the Wanderer. You know what? No, I know exactly why White's in this deck. The Wanderer. It's not for Oath of Kaya. Um, it's definitely for the Wanderer. What the what the Wanderer does is this. Um, it prevents. Um, non-combat damage um, uh, and it's really decent in that regard uh, and it's it can be exploited by command the dreadhorde you know these two it's a co combo see more combo shit Whew. so uh, that's the idea you bring out the wanderer and then you take absolutely everything out of all the graveyards and put it well, one everything, planeswalkers and creatures, out of graveyards and put it into play under your control. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty good. Uh, you know, well, Larry David had, uh, had an opinion. So, yeah, that's what this is trying to do. It's trying to uh, leverage value from black planeswalkers until you can just... Apparently, they're a planeswalker deck, too, and it looks like they're... Probably a five-color Planeswalker deck. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. I have just a Dusk Legion Zealot out there. and I don't even care about their uh, Planeswalker. I'm, I'm face. The face is the place, guys. I have an Elder Spell in hand, too. That's pretty neat. Like, the Elder Spell is mostly com to combo off with my Planeswalkers. The fact that other people are playing Planeswalkers, and I have Elder Spell available to me, is awesome and nuts, and I don't believe it. It's, it's whatever. So. And I'll probably sack my Dusk Legion Zealot creature there. I think I thought about sacrificing my Dusk Legion Zealot, but that means I would have to sack Davriel, and I'm not going to do that because I want to make them discard again. Mm-hmm. I'm looking at my hands. I'm like, do I have options? Maybe. Maybe I do. Maybe I don't. Oh, another one? Let's draw more cards. God, I love drawing cards. Drawing cards is like the most erotic thing you can do. God. Pay to life. But what? Okay. That's what I thought, past Dave. Yeah. Shadow Mage. Yeah, they got a bunch of Planeswalkers in their deck, and I have Elder Spell. This is the greatest thing in the world. All right. Let's keep going. Let's keep going with this. What am I going to discard? What? What am I going to discard, guys? Is it Liliana's Triumph? I have two of them. All right. Now, the bummer here is that they're going to get to uh, reanimate a Planeswalker. But, again... Oh my god, I have Elder Spell. So, uh, I can kill just about all the Planeswalkers. And that's fine. That's pretty good. I like their deck though. It's it has it has mad Dave energy, which is what I say, never. So, hmm. Combo. I have the combo in hand. I don't have the mana to cast Command the Dreadhorde. But really, put out the Wanderer now. I, I guess I'm doing it because in case I draw a land, 
Although, well, you know, um, Chandra can't deal damage to my face, I don't think. Interesting. Alright. Well, Sarkin, that's bad. That's really bad for us. That's that's not good, Sarkin isn't. Turn thing turn his planeswalkers into creatures and they can kill the wanderer. Oh no. Unless they just go face. Oh, oh, they don't care about the Wanderer. I get it. Three, eight, so eleven. Take ten damage here. Do I Elder Spell here? I mean, I think I'm kind of forced to, right? I'm just Elder Spelling. Oh my god, this is... Orgasmic. Oh man. Oh god, yes. That is beautiful. Oh, that is nice. Thank you, opponent. Oh man. I elder spelled their board. That is, uh, that's great. Chasmina, enigmatic mentor, yeah. That's a song someone wrote. All right. Now they can't kill the Wanderer because the Wanderer is tough AF. So I'm gonna probably just command the Dreadhorde here, right? They're going face, they don't care. The face is the place. They're going to deal two, three, four, five. Now they're just going to deal four. All right, man, down to three. Command that dread horde. Gideon, Dovin, that one, that one, that one, that one. That one. Do I even win this though? Is it even possible for me to win this? Because they got enough damage, right? I only have three life. I think I would still lose, right? Because they have two, four, six. They have six damage. I can only block zero of it. Alright, well. Now they deal three, but that's precisely the life I'm at. Oh, damn! I forgot about that part. Yeah, no, that dragon's huge. And I get to... Oh, my. Never mind. Uh, everything's fine. Everything's fine, you guys. I have too many planeswalkers. I don't know what to do with all of them. I have to use the, the scrolling thing. All right. Chandra. Fire Artisan. What? I don't want to... Maybe because I don't have mana? Interesting. Interesting choice not to activate Chandra. I guess I want to cast the spells that come up? I don't know. Interesting. Well, the... Cool. I, I don't recall any misplays up to this point. If you see them, by all means, put it in there. Um, I'm just enjoying watching these games. Uh, I enjoy watching me do the thing. This has been really good. Yep, going face. Oh, lovely. Oh, Sark and the Masterless. This is not good. Kill the Servo. Kill the Servo. Oh man, what a, what a what a beautiful game! Well, I don't know why I did it in that order. 
That was, well, no, I guess I wanted to draw a card. Fair. I did want to draw a card. And that's it. Um, what a game. What a crazy game. You know what? We're going to do a second one. Okay. So, here we are. Um, little bonus mini game. This one's about four minutes long. So, well, when the thing happens, it's going to happen. Uh, this deck is designed to destroy all your lands and then exile them from the graveyard. Don't worry, you'll see the combo. Ooh, well, it's coming. Uh, so, Orzhov again. I'm overlapping on colors. I tend to really like Orzhov decks. Sorry, green, black and white's really nice. I like it. Um, I like how they interact with each other. I like that they're both uh, really... Uh, oof, the removal in that suite is just, just super good. And I don't have to play blue. Well, I like blue. Blue does a lot of really wild things. But I don't, it's also the color that makes me the most angry because I'm like, I don't want to get countered and it makes me upset. So, black and white, destroy all your lands and then take them away. That's what this does. Um, so, and the combo is coming. I'm not even going to tell you what it is. If you think you know the combo before you get to the end, put it in the comments. I'm also playing one of my favorite archetypes of all time, Gates. So I feel bad because I'm beating up on something that I truly love. All right, um, I'm I'm not gonna lie. I I have one of the combo pieces in my hand, but you know I'm just saying uh, it's a it's two combo, it's two card two card combo that you have to play them in a certain order, and it's gotta go a certain way. But uh, yeah, no, it, this is a really mean deck. Land destruction is uh, uh, just like I find. Counter spells to be unfun when they are done in a grotesque, repetitive sense. I also find uh, that a lot of people don't like land destruction. I tend to be okay with it. It's brutal. It's incredibly brutal. But, you know what? It's, you know, I don't like yucking people's yum. And I don't think you should yuck people's yum either, Evan. I, I, I know you watch, and I know that you yuck people's yum and it's obnoxious so Evan stop this gates deck hasn't played anything yet they've just played gates I've let them do their thing they're just kind of kind of chilling they just looking to like put out all the gates and then cast all their colossi for free is that their angle and it's a combo okay so while we're doing nothing, Fall of the Thran and Phyrexian Scriptures. Uh, that is the combo. Um, you get the Phyrexian Scriptures out first. Then you let the Phyrexian Scriptures tick down once. The third one is you exile your opponent's graveyards. Not yours, mind you, just your opponent's. You play that first, and then on your next turn, you play Fall of the Thran. Like so. Fall of the Thran comes out and destroys all the lands. Uh, you With your treasures, if you want, you can play another Fountain of Renewal. Because uh, you like to have fun when you play Magic. Um, they, uh, they don't have any lands in hand think they'll pass. Now, the important thing here is you need to stack the triggers the right way. So when the triggers come up, you want... I, yeah, you, what you do is you want uh, this one to go off first so that your opponents can't get their lands back from their graveyard and that is the game. No misplays, nothing but expert play because our opponents obviously cast everything they could. We don't even know what cards they had in their deck. Wild. Anyway, that's it. I'm done. That's more bad magic, and uh, have a good night. Except for uh, um, Evan?